Hello and welcome to My Society's demonstration on Fix My Street for Councils. This is part one and it will show you what your users will see when they visit the website to make a report. In 2007, we built a national website, fixmystreet.com, with the aim of making street fault reporting as simple as it could be for both residents and for councils. Now we've developed Fix My Street for Councils, allowing you to bring the award-winning Fix My Street experience directly to your own council's website and your residents. Fix My Street for Councils creates a council-branded, seamless fault reporting interface for your website, integrating directly with your back office systems and is available via web or mobile device. As you can see, I have the homepage up in front of me and this can be used for your residents to report any street related problems such as abandoned vehicles, graffiti, potholes, fly tipping, dog fouling, damaged landscapes, verges, public toilets, roads, highways, parks, public footpaths, street lighting, damaged trees and traffic light faults. We can also add in additional problems or in other category if you feel there are important issues that your residents should be able to let you know about. Here I can show you how we integrate this onto council's websites such as Oxfordshire with its own branding and style, Hart District Council, Bromley London Borough Council, and even the city of Zurich in Switzerland. As you will see as I return, each are in the similar style as the main Fix My Street website platform. However, they are individually branded with your own logo, colour scheme and personal details. but for the sake of ease, I'm going to describe to you how it works using our main platform. We have an easy way to help your residents report your problem with four steps, telling them exactly how to do this. We have a list of recently reported problems in which your residents can see re uh, the reported problems in their area and an easy place for them to download the mobile application from the Apple App Store or the Android App Store. But let's get down to business. You can report, view or discuss local problems here. If you are out and about, you can just click locate me automatically, which would immediately find your position on the map. However, in this case, I am doing this from a desktop in an office, so I don't think the location it would find me would have many problems. So for the sake of ease, I'm going to input a postcode I found earlier. Select go and it will take me to a map like this. The user can use it when you zoom in and zoom back out to pinpoint the exact positioning. They can also move from side to side and up and down if they know a nearby postcode but not quite the one of where the problem is. They can click on a report that's been made previously, find the title for that, look at the details, and we can see here, this was submitted on the 7th of August by a user who gave a, a reasonable description. And we have an update from the council. Now either the resident or the council can mark this as fixed and we can see that above the big green fixed marker comes up along here. However, this wasn't the report I wanted to make and I wanted to make a different report. So I couldn't find it pinpointing on the map. How about scrolling on this column on the left hand side? This one looks similar as my report was about bicycle. So if I click on here, I can see that this person had actually submitted an image to go along with the report and their description. When we click on a report, it does remove the other markers, making it very clear which is the marker you're looking at. And again, you can do the same process to zoom in to see the exact positioning. Oxfordshire County Council have also come back to this report, saying that the appropriate agency has been told about the problem, but it has not been marked as fixed yet, so we can only assume this problem is remaining. If I wanted to, I could provide an update 
or say it has been fixed if I've recently walked past and noticed that there has been a repair. However, again, this is not the report I would like to make, so I'm going to click back and return. This comes to the end of the viewing section for Fix My Street for Councils, and next I will be covering how your residents can make a report to you via Fix My Street.